back to my channel and this is your September reading from Anything Spiritual. Firstly, I'd just like to say thank you for all the likes and subscribes and the comments that my channel received last month. I'm always very grateful for all the support. Also, I'll put a link in the description below to my sister's channel, Mind's Eye and Inspiration. She also releases monthly videos and she has books and things as well. We do different books, so um, she'll have information to that on her channel. So if you want to pop along there and have a look at what she's doing. Now, I was asking what the month ahead holds for Aries and two cards came out for you, the Nine of Cups and the Three of Cups. Now, the Nine of Cups um, is often referred to as the Wish card. And obviously, with both of these cards being Cups, Minor Arcana, there doesn't seem to be major things going on for you this month. So, But what I felt was, with having two Cup cards come out, the Three and the Nine, a lot to do with emotions this month, a lot to do with your feelings and you're probably not a star sign to necessarily sit there and talk about your feelings Aries but this month definitely seems to be about emotions, quite possibly family, you know things close to your heart and um, the three of cups is often like family celebrations so you have the wish card there and you have um, sort of you know family celebrations so what I felt for you is um, September's about emotions and wishes coming true. So that was your message I felt for you for September 2021. And we will pull some more cards and we'll see what other messages the cards have for you for September. You've got the Six of Wands, the Five of Cups, the Ten of Cups and the Emperor. Now that three that came out there earlier, threes are also advancement. It's making a decision and it's taking a step forward. Now look at the six of wands here. Again, you've got an advancement card come out, a moving forward. So there seems to be um, a moving forward for you in September. Dropping all the cards. So this moving forward is obviously something emotionally that's going to make you happy because we've already got this message about dreams coming true. It's moving forward. It's something that's going to make you feel better, make you feel more relaxed, uh, make you feel happier. So there's a definite advancement in the month of September. You are moving forward and it seems to be you leading the way. Now this five of cups there, Vibes are about changes, they can be about instability, they can be about, this card can often be about looking at what is lost, but I don't think that's, in this reading, what it's really referring to, I feel it's more to do with changes, there's something changing, something changing which means you're moving ahead, it means you're advancing, and it means things are better for you emotionally, so this change needs to happen, I don't necessarily feel there's any negativity about looking at anything lost, um, for me, that five is just signifying changes and there's definite changes in the air for you in September. But because those cards that came out with your message are minor arcana, this is nothing major. We've already said that. So it seems like September you're going to be plodding along, but you will be advancing forward in some way. And you are definitely going to be feeling happier. Because like we said before, we had two cup cards. We had the nine, which is the wish card. And you've got the 10 here. So it's almost like having everything around you that you want. You know, money, abundance, um, things coming in. So September seems quite a good month and you're going to be in quite a good place. We've got the Emperor card here. The Emperor can also signify Dad. So things could be really good around a dad or a, or a father figure. Things going really well the way you want it. So this happiness and this... Um, abundance and things coming in here could also be linked to dad. Um, for those of you where it isn't, um, there could just be somebody helping you or advising you, um, supporting you, um, which could be a dad or a father figure. But there is um, the Emperor card here is involved in your reading. So let's just put another tarot here to clarify the Emperor card in this reading. Can we just clarify the Emperor card in this reading please? 
and then we'll move on to the bottom row and this card wants to come out and it is the page of swords now pages when they often come out they are messages okay again this one could to do with changes plans and delays and things like that so there are some changes there's some plans quite possibly around dad in the month of september things changing but it, it seems to be um happy because we've got you know good emotions and things coming out there so there's quite possibly some ch changes and some plans around dad in the month of september for you something seems to be happening quick is this the plans is this the changes but something seems to be happening quick for you because we've got that seven of swords there okay sevens are also about a new approach so again something new you've got to put in new plans new changes doing something new again is this around dad or is, is dad helping you with this the Empress is about the homemaker, it's about grounding, it's about stability and it's what you seem to be doing. So this seems to be creating a bit more stability, a bit more balance for you, okay? Another seven, again, looking at paths, looking at new approach, looking at um, how you're changing things, how you're doing things. So we're definitely making changes and we're looking at it. And we've got a card here about feeling trapped. Now I don't think this is you Aries because your messages so far have been really really good but perhaps that's how you've been feeling perhaps these changes and this new approach is to get rid of a feeling of feeling trapped feeling that you can't get out of a situation is there something you felt you've had to do and you didn't want to and then in the month of September it's all going to change and you haven't got to do this so whatever you felt was being put on you is you know changing and it's it's not happening anymore and you're going to be feeling better about it so whatever it is there are plans changing um, there are definite changes in September it's not anything too major and if it was something that you wasn't feeling happy about and feeling trapped you're going to be escaping from that situation so this is probably why you're going to be feeling happier. These are Guardian Angel cards, Aries. And let's have a look at what that says for you. Two of emotion. A relationship grows closer as two people fall in love. A current relationship grows much stronger. Friendships may deepen into a spiritual connection. Mutual respect and understanding exist or will develop don't give up on a relationship that feels challenging to you there's still hope okay for some of you this could be in the area of a love relationship for some of you is this your relationship of dad if any of you perhaps wasn't getting on so well with dad or somebody that is a sort of a father figure to you a relationship is improving the changes are you know sorry it suddenly stopped recording so for some of you it will be the relationship with dad is getting better or another relationship around you is improving but that card definitely talks about coming together a relationship improving a relationship getting stronger and we definitely said it was about emotions this month and um you know and wishes coming true so this is obviously something you've wanted you've wanted this relationship to get better you've wanted this change whatever's coming in in september for you is something you've been thinking about something that you've been wanting and it looks like it's coming in for you aries but again it may not be anything particularly major just something that you thought oh, that would be nice if that would change and it looks like it's going to and your guardian a saints and angel card is faith so have faith aries this is happening this is happening in the month of september have faith that this relationship is growing closer now let's have a look at your love and relationship cards for some of you this may already resonate in the area of relationships for some of you it won't and it says is it safe for you to love again open your heart and give and receive the highest energy of all so another card about you know telling you it's okay to to trust and it's okay to open your heart and it's okay to get that bit closer because that is what's happening this month. We've already said that a relationship is growing stronger. We've already had that message. And then this one, express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. So this month just seems to be about relationships and emotions for you, Aries. And it's just basically saying that it's safe for you to tell people how you feel. It's safe for you to say yes, I'm happy about this, or yeah, shall we, you know, take things a little bit further? 
it's given you that green light Aries to go ahead, make deeper connections, um, bring relationships closer, whether it's a partner, whether it's a dad, but it definitely looks like changes for you in September and relationships getting stronger and getting closer together. Wow, Aries, I hope you've enjoyed this reading. Um, I hope you have a good month. Thank you for watching and I'll see you again soon.